What's up guys, Jason from Earth Motor Cars here. Today is a very special day. I get to review one of my favorite vehicles of all time. I used to have posters of this thing on my wall as a child. My dad actually to this day still has posters of this thing on his wall. What we have here today is not a 1960s AC Cobra. However, what it is, is a 2020 RT4 Cobra from Backdraft Racing. Now you can find this Cobra as well as other classics, customs, hot rods, exotics, and luxury vehicles at earthmotorcars.com. I'll put a link in the description below. So for these reviews, we're going to be scoring vehicles in five main categories. Looks, performance, comfort, tunnel sound, and the valet test. That's where we find out if the car is cool enough to be parked up front. So our first category is looks, and of course I'm going to be a little bit biased in this department as the original AC Cobra design is by far the most beautiful car that's ever been made, in my opinion. So of course, this RT4 Cobra from Backdraft Racing being modeled after that is already off to a great start. Now, the color combination on this particular one is absolutely a knockout. And one of the things I was mostly impressed with this is the attention to detail. I mean, going into the interior, the carbon fiber dash, the stitching, everything just flows really well. It's, it's very elegant and just an absolute knockout. Number one, looks. Five out of five, all day, every day. This thing is turning heads. People are stopping to take photos. While making this video, I had at least 20 people come up and want to talk about this thing. Absolutely five out of five. Next category we want to look at is performance. So for that, let's go ahead and hop in and take the show on the road. mentioned earlier this thing has a 427 in here making 480 horsepower that's paired with a t5 five-speed manual transmission from Tremec This thing is actually, it's actually handling quite nice. Now, of course, that's due to the folks over at Backdraft Racing uh, building the chassis on this thing and the suspension specifically for track day fun. Now, next category I want to go over is comfort. Now, for what it is, not bad. Drives pretty smooth. Now, overall, I'm going to have to give it a three and a half out of five for comfort. It's a little hard to get in and out of. It's a little bumpy. There's no roof, obviously, so you have to wait for a nice day. Obviously, today is a very nice day, so I'm thankful for that. But I think for what it is, a track car, a date night car, three and a half for comfort's not bad. Just as a quick recap for looks, we got a five out of five. Performance, five out of five. For comfort, three and a half out of five. Coming up, we have the tunnel sound test followed by the valet test. This is the tunnel test. What's that? You guys want to hear that again? Okay. I mean, seriously, words cannot describe how much joy it brings me to hear the noises that come out of this thing. Next up, we have the valet test. For that, we're heading to one of the nicest parts of town, Legacy West. On 
any given day here in Legacy West, you're liable to see all kinds of supercars, classic cars, and really just anything that's expensive. So really, I think this is the best proving grounds. We're going to go over to Fogo de Chao, see what the valet stand does with the car. Remember, guys, uh, the only way to pass this test is if your car is cool enough to be left up front for all to see. So there you have it. By default, it wins the valet pest. Five out of five. If the guy can't drive it, it has to stay up front. Just a quick recap. We gave it a five out of five on performance. Five out of five on looks. I wish I could give it a six. We're also gonna give it a three and a half on comfort to be expected uh, with a track spec vehicle like that. The tunnel noise was absolutely fantastic. That also gets a five out of five. So thanks for tuning in guys. As always, link in the description below, earthmotorcars.com for vehicles just like this one and others that you wanna see on our inventory list. Give us a call at this number right here and we'll see you next time.